Happy Monday, everyone. Thanks for checking it as we take a look at the northeastern regional forecast. We're going to be tracking Chris, of course, just off the eastern coastline. Uh, this is a, a tropical storm, at least as of early on Monday. Could become a hurricane, though, but uh, we do expect to see some uh, stronger rip current potential along the east coast. So keep that in mind if you're going to be heading to any beaches over the next few days. Spotty storms will be possible tomorrow as the front moves in from the west-northwest, but not quite as hot here this week. I know last week we had a number of those uh, heat advisories and excessive heat warnings, so not as bad. But there's a look at Tropical Storm Chris, and there is the east coast of uh, North Carolina. So again, we expect to see this maybe turning into a hurricane as early as tomorrow and then tracking northeast away from the east coastline. So that is uh, wonderful news. But again, as I mentioned, we will have some stronger rip current potential along beaches along the uh, east coast there. All right, temperatures yesterday were into the 80s, uh, looking at a pretty quiet day today, of course, with not even a thunder threat across much of the region. Tomorrow, though, we do have a general thunderstorm threat with the marginal risk of severe weather from southwestern Pennsylvania to uh, Cincinnati, Ohio. And then that front drops to the south on Wednesday, so we're quieter behind that. So again, kind of watching Chris to the south of us, and then this front to the north moving in as we head into our Tuesday. That'll kick out some showers and thunderstorms. Could actually have a few of uh, those uh, outer bands trying to uh, reach the uh, mid-Atlantic coast, but there's your rainfall over the next couple of days, which doesn't look all that impressive. Have a good one.